Hello everyone and welcome. In this video, we will talk about what is tokenization and how do we perform tokenization using NLTK library in Python. So here I have this text, right? So I have this text we call this as corpus in NLP. So we have hello everyone, Fordnun welcomes you all, right? So here if you perform tokenization, here each and every word is going to be to have some tokens so each and every word you are going to split it and store this as a token right so in your corpus whatever word that you have you are going to have tokens and you are going to store that into a list format so this is the word tokenization there is also something called as sentence tokenization so in sentence tokenization you tokenize all the sentence so here hello everyone is going to be your first token and code none welcomes you all and full stop it is going to be your second token right so here let's see how do we perform this tokenization in python so first of all import nltk library so we are going to make use of this nltk library which is mostly used for your NLP tasks and again we are going to download so NLTK dot download and we are going to download this func P U N K T so this is a library that you have to download to tokenize your sentences and word and we are going to make use of it right and also import from NLTK dot tokenize from nltk dot tokenize import your sent that is sentence tokenizer tokenize comma your word underscore tokenize all right now let's run this so it is going to take a while to download it now we have downloaded the punkt to root nltk data folder all right then we have this package punk is already up to date all right so now let's understand how this tokenization work so first of all let's perform the word tokenization so we are going to make use of this word tokenize from this nltk right so you just have to write word underscore tokenize your text here so your text here that is your data so we have this data in variable text right and now if i run it you'll see that we have a list and every each and every word and character has been tokenized right so here we have a list and in list we have these words this is hello then everyone then we have full stop then code none right then we have exclamation mark then welcomes then we have you all then full stop right so this is your word tokenization also similarly to perform sentence tokenization we can write sent tokenize and here you pass this data that is text inside this braces all right so let's run this and here if you see we have got a list of list of your three tokens right so everything it has formed a sentence tokenizer using this full stop and exclamation mark right so it is using this full stop and exclamation mark this punctuation to form you to give you a sentence tokenized list right so this is how we perform this tokenization using this nltk library in python so i hope it is clear to you now and for many such video please subscribe to our youtube channel and press the bell icon thank you